I'm Rancho Palos Verdes City Manager Ara Moranian with an update from the February 21st City Council meeting. The RPV City Council addressed a wide range of items. The issues included fire insurance coverage, a proposed history museum, and the city's goal to pursue acquiring the Point Vicente Lighthouse and the Battery Barns Bunker properties. The council authorized the mayor to send a letter to the U.S. Coast Guard and federal legislators expressing the city's continued interest in acquiring both the landmark lighthouse property on Palos Verdes Drive South and Battery Barns, a 3.9-acre site next to City Hall that houses a World War II era bunker. City staff recently met with U.S. Coast Guard officials regarding safety, maintenance, and aesthetic concerns at these two locations. The Coast Guard has indicated that while the properties are being evaluated for divestiture, funds won't be allocated to re repaint the lighthouse and maintain the sites. In the meantime, the Coast Guard has resumed doing free monthly lighthouse tours and will give tours during the city's annual Whale of a Day event on April 15th at Point Vicente Interpretive Center. Meanwhile, discussions resumed over a proposal to build a history museum next to the Point Vicente Interpretive Center at Lower Point Vicente. The Palos Verdes Historical Society has requested building a 5,000 square foot museum on city property using private funds. Upon completion, the museum would be deeded to the city. The Kendida Civic Center was also being considered as a possible location. After listening to public testimony, the city council members decided that more information and community input was needed and voted to receive the staff report, but did not direct staff to proceed with the project at this time. Finally, RPV residents can expect to receive information and a survey regarding wildfire insurance coverage and fire prevention measures. The council approved drafting a survey after receiving a report on resources available for wildfire property coverage and the growing number of uninsured residents. For more information on these issues, watch the City Council meeting on RPV TV or the City's website at rpvca.gov. Let's stay connected and remember, we're RPV together.